specter of Obama. But at least they were Republicans. I mean, Tara, what about this whole idea of a third party? I mean, it, it, it seems a very uphill climb for that. It, it, it is. And, um, you know, I'm, I'm one of those people, along with Amanda, along with Stuart, that as a principled conservative who spent my entire adult life fighting for constitutional conservatism, for limited government, for uh, individual liberty, against a liberalism, a liberalism, against the policies of people like Hillary Clinton. This is a very dismaying, disappointing moment for me that, um, that the primary electorate has basically uh, had a midlife crisis and decided to like cash in their 401k and buy a Harley and just say the hell with it all and go across <laughs> America. I mean, that's like, you know, whatever happens, happens. I mean, that's what we're doing here with Donald Trump. I mean, he does not represent represent anything that, uh, that, uh, that conservatives represent. He barely represents anything Republicans represent. I don't know what Republican Party moves forward, what it looks like moving forward with someone like him at the head of it. Ross, you wrote today this is a defeat for conservatism. Yeah, I mean, I meant I, capital T, capital C. I was using the term to basically describe Ted Cruz's theory, right, which was that